Hey, level uppers, it's Larry, and this is a lore overview of one of my favorite city zones in EverQuest, Paineal. On Project 1999's green server, Paineal was added on September 4th, 2020. With the addition of the city, the ability to create erudite shadow knights is now a reality. This also brought a few other changes to the server to include shrink potions, special quests, and additional necromancer spells such as the highly anticipated subversion line, better known as Twitch. At the time of this recording, there are no comprehensive patch notes to highlight all of the changes, but what I wanted to do in this video is to actually outline the lore of Paineal and how it came into existence, because I feel like it's truly a fascinating tale. So here we go. Paineal is the city where worshippers of Kazakh Bull reside, also known as Kazakhites. And this was not necessarily by choice. Practitioners of necromancy once lived within the gates of Iridin amongst the Erudites. However, due to their unrelenting practice of this forbidden art, the powerful necromancers were outcasted from Iridin and subsequently labeled as heretics. A battle of epic proportions took place as the followers of Irud wanted to extinguish all that remained of these followers of the God of Fear. The battle was cataclysmic and at its apex, a massive tear into the earth was created by the impressive escalation of magical damage done by both sides. Both sides responsible for this irreparable damage were shaken to their cores and decided to cease any additional conflict for the time being. The heretics could no longer organize their efforts openly and had to retreat into the cavernous depths of what is now known as the Hole. Being secluded not only bought them time, but also gave the illusion that they had completely phased out from existence. This could not have been any further. This is where and when the original city of Paniel was born and gave way to the heretics to practice their dark art of necromancy uninterrupted. While exploring the depths of their now thriving underground city, they discovered a curious item called the Vault of Living Stone. This was a self-repairing artifact created by the god Brel Celeris, intended to serve as a magical seal to protect Norad from the Plain of Underfoot, which was riddled with vicious elementals and other unsavory types. The heretics, determined to try to figure out how to harness the artifact's powers, managed to damage it just enough to break the safety seal that kept Nora safe for so long. The full regret of their mistake wasn't fully realized until Earthen Lord Yale and Underfoot's denizens swarmed through what is now the Broken Seal and, in quick fashion, demolished Paniel and its residents. With their intelligence and maybe even a stroke of luck, the heretics were able to repair the seal and keep any additional creatures from the Underfoot at bay but their old city of Paniel would never be occupied by them again, and was now occupied by Earthen Lord Yale and his horde. The surviving heretics that managed to flee relocated their efforts and found a suitable location near the top of the chasm that was just out of reach of any harm. In memory of what was lost, the heretics named their newfound city and what we now get to experience on Project 1999's green server as Paniel. That's all I have. I hope you enjoyed a little bit of a lore session around the city of Paniel. Looking forward to doing some more content like this in the future, especially as we get closer to Kunark. Just as a reminder, we have a thriving Discord community, so make sure to check the description below to see how you can join that server. And also, for those of you who don't know, I also stream on Twitch Sundays, Tuesdays, and Thursdays starting at around 8.30 p.m. Central. So feel free to come check me out over there. Appreciate you watching. Thanks for everything. We'll see you next time. Level up hype!